I'm Dr. Brent Clyde, neurological surgeon, providing expert guidance when a neurosurgical solution is an option for your condition. Do you experience intense, sharp, jabbing pain in your forehead, cheek, or jaw? Have you had unexplained dental pain despite evaluation and dental procedures? You may have trigeminal neuralgia, sometimes called tic de la rue. The trigeminal nerve is also known as the fifth cranial nerve. It primarily provides sensation to the face and has a smaller component for the muscles of chewing and biting. Pain from the trigeminal nerve can occur from various causes, such as multiple sclerosis, also known as MS, tumors on the nerve, or compression of the nerve by a small artery or vein. The most common cause is vascular compression of the nerve by a small artery or less likely a vein, as the nerve leaves the brainstem. This can cause sharp, lancinating pain on one side of the face, most often in only one or two of the three divisions, the forehead, the cheek, or the jaw. Trigeminal neuralgia can easily be misdiagnosed. Dental procedures such as root canals are frequently used in an attempt to treat dental pain that is actually trigeminal neuralgia. There is no simple accurate test for trigeminal neuralgia. A good history from the patient is the best way to diagnose the condition. An MRI is used to exclude other conditions like multiple sclerosis or tumors. Aside from MRI, other testing is generally not needed. The primary medical treatment is carbamazepine, brand name Tegretol. This medication slows nerve firing and can quiet an overactive nerve. A good initial response to Tegretol helps confirm the diagnosis of trigeminal neuralgia. Other medications are used, but are not as effective. If you're considering a surgical solution to your pain, your dentist or primary physician has likely exhausted treatment options for you. You may have tried more than one medication, dental procedures, or other options. When performed by skilled neurological surgeons, procedures for trigeminal neuralgia have success rates of 80 to 90 percent. I perform microvascular decompression, also known as the Janetta procedure. I trained under Dr. Janetta at the University of Pittsburgh. Microvascular decompression is the only procedure designed to relieve the source of the pain, a vessel compressing the nerve. In this procedure, the surgeon enters the skull behind the ear through a small two-inch incision and a one-inch opening in the bone. The nerve is then explored to find the compressing blood vessel. Once found, the vessel is moved aside and a small piece of padding is placed between the vessel and the nerve to hold the vessel off the nerve. Often a small groove is seen in the nerve where the vessel was compressing it. Microvascular decompression can give permanent relief with little or no numbness to the face. This is a very elementary overview of trigeminal neuralgia and one possible solution. Other solutions are available such as injections of glycerol in the nerve or focused radiation to the nerve. If your doctor or dentist thinks this may be your problem, you will need to have an MRI of the brain and I would be happy to review your history and imaging and consult as appropriate. To learn more about trigeminal neuralgia, please visit my website at www.ebrainmd.com. You will find more detailed information and be able to request a consultation.